In this video, I will introduce you to Canva, a powerful online design tool, and we will create a simple design using custom scene simplified version. Hi, it's Roman from Custom Scene. Canva allows you to create design on, from their website or from their iPad app. Just create an account and you can use it for free. Once you've created your account, here's the first screen you'll get. On the top area, you'll have all the preset designs ready to use. For this example, we're going to use the first one, the social media presets, which is 800 pixel by 800 pixel. Once we click, it opens a new canvas. I won't go in deep into all the features of canva.com, but I will just show you how to use simplified version of custom scene. So we're now going to add the images we want to use in our design into our library. So to do so, we go to our folder, and this is a folder of the, uh, the Flower Edition Volume 1. And we could simply by selecting them all, and by clicking and dragging into our library, we could upload all the, the, the images we, we want to. So just for the sake of this uh, tutorial, we just select um, a few images. So um, I'll go to, um, to this flower, clicking and dragging it into the library and we can see it's here and just start using and designing clicking and dragging into our canvas the next image the same and we could use several images at the same time as well we could select two images okay so let's add those into our canvas And you got the controls. So once you select um, an item, you got the controls here. We could uh, resize it, but you could also uh, rotate the the image. You could do the same here. Let's uh, and let's add uh, some other images. So some petals. Petal here. Can bring them to bring them to our canvas. One of the um, one of those features that is available in Canva.com is to you could you able to bring forward or backward the, the elements. So this right now this petal is hiding the. the flower so we want to bring it to the back so we just select it and then we can do like that just by bringing it to the back the same with this one or or the opposite we could bring this flower forward so yeah so let's add some text to, uh, to this design here near the text tool can add some uh, a heading You know, we could choose uh, among uh, hundreds of fonts available on cover.com, which is quite handy. We want to do uh, a nice design. We're going to use the, uh, the playlist script. Can we make it bigger. Maybe that for now. Um, we could select and copy the element again. Down. Where you are planted. Change the front of that. Can I use the spun? Um, I'm going to make it uppercase. Make it smaller. Put it a bit more smaller again. Yep. Center it. Okay, and um, we could also group the, the text together by selecting both text and using command uh, G. And here you go, you've got the, the group of the text, so it's easy to, to edit. You could resize the text if you wish, and you could uh, just bring it to the, to the center. So we could also play around with those elements, could maybe uh, 
bring some elements to, to the front, bring them forward. Actually, I'm gonna add uh, some more, some other graph, some more images. I'm gonna add some leaves. Question that I hear: rose leaves. Um, gonna select uh, maybe two of those. Gonna also um, add a color background. Gonna try to go for um, darker. Okay. Um, I will think I will change the uh, the font, uh, the font color. So we're gonna we'll have to ungroup the font. And select the font here and change it to white. Yeah, I'm trying to find the right composition here. Okay, so this is our design, and um, being um, be able to create those designs on cover.com could just um, so we could save it by asking you save it automatically yeah, it's done and um, here you go the option to share it or the option to uh, to download it and that will be uh, useful for your social network your blog or whatever um, content you want to use it for there's um, JPEG version P uh, PNG as well PNG version so we're gonna download the JPEG for now. And here is our design. By the way, there's a link in the description below to download for free all images used in this video. I hope you find this video useful so you can start designing with custom scene using Canva. Thanks for watching.